Or we have a FIBA 3 Extreme logo cut into the field behind us, but you know what? That doesn't matter. No matter where we are, we will bring the action. And the action has just started in this Pool C game. Well, we'll get things started up right. And then a steal. Must see TV getting his mitts on the ball. They go back to Guo. Guo sharing this time. Easy layup. Zhang. Young Ren Shen. Shen it is. Get that layup to go down. So a quick 3-0 lead for Fushan. Again, are probably looking to take advantage of the fact that Beijing is without one of their best players, Olympic gold medalist Carlos Las Manas. This man also an Olympic gold medalist, by the way, so they still have one of them to contend with. He did foul Guo on the drive there. So Han Yu Guo will step to the line. And that's Cash. So just like in the first game, Beijing got blitzed a little bit. It's been Han Yu Guo. Team's third leading score at 5.2 per game on the pro circuit this year. You know what? Look at that. The Dragon's back, and he's dropping in buckets right away. 5-0 to zero on the hook shot. What kind of fish is he trying to catch with that? On the other end, finally an answer for Team Beijing. Lou drops it in. Dragovic. Feisty to start things off. That one's a miss. Foul and a rebound called a must-see TV. That'll be number one on Fujian. So we get reset for Beijing. Miezes is on the bench. Will they turn to Ju again? Because he was nice. Call the foul on the floor. Take a look at Miez's nutmeg Zhang on that pass. And that will be uh, again called on the floor. Wo takes his seat in the maze. He gets lost in his own sauce. Offensive foul called on Zhang. By himself, he kicks it to Zhu, but yeah, layup might have been a better option on that. Masi TV for Vore underneath the Zhang and Futian just keep on scoring. 
Big load to handle down there. They go looking for him in the post. Must see TV. Has to extend the foul on him. Now Zhu is stepping back. That was not good. Whoa, back on the court. He's got the two man game with Zhang. He steps back this time. Whoa, no make, but Zhang's there to get his back. Foul on the floor, though. Jang wants to get a continuation on that. He says the bucket was down. Referees think differently. The Dragon again with the hook shot. He's hunting for big fish. 10 to three. Lou, no answer. Oh, that's safe. Oh, I thought that was safe. See, I was too early. I thought that was saved in bounds, but it ended up going out of bounds. Oh, Floaty on must see TV. Don't no make dope. The maze with the board. Mies. That layup will go. I don't know what Dragovic has been doing in his time off, but he's been working on that hook shot. He's gone down three times already. Dragovic, this time he goes to the, well, still goes to the right. scoop de doop 12 to four in a uh, one-sided contest so far. Team Beijing is missing in action a little bit. So we've gotten to our TV timeout here. And uh, again, a bit of a lopsided contest. This uh, has been Team Fuxian's game. And scoring this one uh, so far is uh, uglier than Lil Wayne. 12 to four. Find some offense there, Zhu again. Whoa. Uh, that fake needed some Botox. Travel called on Han Yu Guo. Take a look at Zhu. Smashing that one like a Krabby Patty. Must see TV. Passes down low to Zhang and somehow gets that to go in. In between like four arms too, and it didn't matter. Mies is stepping back. Follow a shot. Got that eight to 13. Now fouls called. He is showing some frustration. He's telling his, his teammates what to do as we take a look back at that beautiful step back. Whoa. Go to Jane. This time it's an offensive foul. So Zhang. Picking up Fuzian's team's uh, seventh foul. They're in the bonus now. Next foul will be two free throws. This one wasn't because it was offensive. Zhu underneath. Righty hook. That's good. So Beijing slowly getting back into this one. Jang going at June. He lost him somewhere. Now 
Now Zhu will take a shot. Don't look now. Beijing's back within three. They look dead in the water, but somehow they've clawed themselves back into this one. Look at Zhu. Hand off the knives, gets the two up. Whoa, to the dragon. Dragovic, no make. Dead in the backward after that one. So a uh, shot clock violation and a reset for Team Beijing, who have an opportunity to really climb back into this one. Pull the game within one or two. Miezes. No make. Try to draw the foul, but there's nothing there. Then a foul is called on Wen Balu. Got sealed out there. Jenkins, whoa. Whoa's using his speed. Oh, he took the fast lane to the cup, 15 to 11. Jew steps back one more time. This one, it's missed. Must see TV, more of a screener in this game. I don't think he's scored yet. Whoa, fires one from the corner. No good. So Lou steps back, the midi. Miss, Jew's got his back, he will not put it in. Somehow, some way, Zhu got that to go. It took him three or four tries. Don't matter though, as long as you keep going. Must see TV finds Zhang underneath. That's a good shot. Then he gets a steal right away. Must see TV open for two. And that's front rim. Lou misses that one. And again, Beijing, they're fighting. Jank this time, easy layup, good seal. Still a four point advantage, Team Fujian. That will get us to our second TV timeout. Team Fujian jumped out to a big, big lead. They were up eight points early on in the game, but Team Beijing's been on a comeback mission. Zhu's been a big part of it. Big rebounds and some shots from the outside. Now don't get me wrong, Beijing still looking at a four point deficit. They got it down to two at some point, and they have possession here. See what kind of play calling they have coming out of a timeout. So, some confusion on whose possession it is. Team Kushan believes they had possession, but they might have thought wrong. Team Green will get the Wilson here. Miezes. Lou steps back. Lou. They needed that one. Miezes, though. Big rebound. Underneath gets blocked by the Dragon. Get that out of there. Bogdan Dragovic now with a two. Can he put the game on ice? No, he cannot. Meyes is spinning. Lose winning. So again, a three-point game still. This ain't over with. Must see TV crossing, fading away on the two-point shot. No goal, but hey, look who's there. Dragovic picks up the rebound. Must see TV again in front rims. He wasn't visible at all early game, and now he's trying to shoot himself back into things. Not working out so far. 2.30 to go. We got a three point game here. Fresh shot clock. Must see TV on his way to the rack. Finds the dragon. Dragovic leading away. Doesn't matter, 18 to 14. Oh, 
So a kickball violation. Will result in a timeout. Both Guo and Musi TV are looking gassed. Both of them wanted to take a seat on that. But Team Fushan still holding on to this four point lead. And again, this year only. It's been a uh, Beijing affair when these two teams have met up. Four wins, Team Beijing, one win for Team Futian, and they're looking to change just that. But you know what? Mies is out here grittier than sandpaper. 18 to 16. Keeps bringing his team back into things. A dragon now. Dragovic kicks it out. Guo using the speed double step back on Guo. And you know what? We've seen this before. That's a travel. You can't be using two step backs in one. Mies is this time with the fake and the easy layup. He lost my CTV like no Google Maps. Report, no, no answer, so Beijing's within one. They got a shot at this. The drive ends up with Chu with the easy put in. 18 to 18, the game is tied. We got a minute and a half to go. The floaty for the Dragons, no good. Zhang with the board. He goes at Chu, but loses to Wilson. We got seven seconds on the shot clock. Zhang heaves one. And that rebound is picked up by the Maze. Again with the timely layup, 19 to 18. He's leading his team all the way back from an eight-point deficit. Must see TV. Find Zhang on the cut. He knows there. Now it's Mies. He can put the game away from the corner. And that one's in and out. Dragovic this time. We're under a minute. Fuchian was holding on to a four-point lead just seconds ago. Now Dragovic ties the game at 19. A two-pointer where things for both teams. Who is open for two? Not a make though. Dragovic this time looking for some space. Mies is trying to guard him. He fouls him. An offensive foul is called on the Dragon for grabbing onto Mies' arm. This will not result in free throws, but it will result in a Beijing possession. That man right there, Nars Mieses, is showing why he's an Olympic champ. Bringing his team all the way back out here in Shanghai. A timeout is called. We got 39.9 seconds on the clock. And we are tied at 19, ladies and gentlemen. This is a big, big game. And Team Beijing already picked up a win in pool play against Antonanari. In Kuxian, this is their first game of the day. So Team Beijing with the play call going to be out of, out of this timeout. They get Mieses open for a two sidestep. Two of ours. Mieses puts the game on ice. No Batman, no worries. As Team Beijing takes care of Team Futian on the back of this step back by Norris Mieses. That man's got more ice in his veins than Rozon. This is Maurice Lacroix buzzer beater right there. Putting away Team Futsi on here. And the Maze, he got them all lost. But not himself, as he leads his team to a 21-19 victory.